Hey, what's the Lego Zora? And I'm back with a new video. And today I'm showing you how to build a custom Lego Iron Knuckle. Obviously, I saw a bunch of different other builds for the Iron Knuckle, but I really wanted my own build. And while it's not the greatest, I do very like how it came out. So yeah, let's get right into this video. These are the pieces you're going to need to build the torso of the Iron Knuckle. And it's also worth noting right here, you can replace three of these with just one of these pieces. I just like the look of it when they're all stacked up together. So yeah, let's get right into the speed build. There you have the torso. These are the pieces you are going to need to build a small extender to the body. And there you have it. These are the pieces you are going to need to build one of the legs, and to build the second leg you will need the exact same pieces, so yeah. There is the leg, and there is the second leg, and obviously it's just the exact same thing, just inverted. These are the pieces you are going to need to build the shoulders of the iron knuckle. And there you have the shoulders. These are the pieces you are going to need to build one of the arms, and the other one is built the exact same way. And there you have one of the arms, and there you have the other holding this giant axe, which I'm sure you know how to build. These are the pieces you are going to need to build the head of the iron knuckle. There you have the head. Now to put all of the parts together, obviously you get the body, you get the legs, you stick them just like so, and then to fill in this little area, you get this small extender piece, and you put it in right there, and then obviously this shoulder piece, you stick on right there. You can get the arms and attach them like so, both of them. And then, obviously, the head goes on the top. Overall, I really like this design. I like the proportionality, especially to other minifigures. I like how it kept it small. Obviously, that sacrifices some articulation, but it still has enough to get it into some of the best poses. I also don't particularly like the back. I think it seems a bit plain, although, again, uh, this right here, I do like that. Uh, just kind of like how it stacks up. Um, so, yeah, if you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Also, if you have any comments at all, please leave them in the comment section below. And did anybody notice uh, the new, um, tablecloth that's red? It's pretty cool. Yeah. So, yeah, see you guys next time.